Hey YouTubers and welcome back to Tony the Technician's channel and today we're going to be going into another product from the Toolbox widget. They came out a few years ago, it's a veteran and mechanic owned company, fantastic company, and they started off with their wrench organizers, they have vertical and angled wrench organizers, angled ones for your little bit larger wrenches that still need to stay in a shallow drawer. And then they also released their screwdriver organizer which is great for not just screwdrivers but extensions, miscellaneous items like that, uh, and they're all very versatile you can connect them and they have spacers so you can make them fit any drawer however you like it's a very very good way to organize your drawer and save a lot of space it's probably the best design out there in order to save space in your drawer because it's not just a stationary unit that is the way it is you can make it the length that you want go any direction that you want it's very nice and very universal so it's great but they also released their new plier organizer. So I have a couple different styles of plier organizers. I have a wire organizer that I got for like 25 or $35, maybe five years ago. And it's been good, no problems with it, but I figured an upgrade to the toolbox widget because I also have the Ernst or Tecton pliers organizer and that thing is fantastic, made in the USA. We're gonna quickly go over the specs and features and everything of this. Uh, toolbox widget pliers organizer and then stay tuned for the next video where they have also released their new socket organizer and we're going to be reorganizing all of the sockets in this husky box and seeing how much space we can save there so stay tuned for that but let's get into the pliers organizer and all of its specs and if you guys are interested there'll be a link down in the description I'll have the toolbox widget website and uh, it's there for you so let's get into this so here we are looking at the toolbox widget modular plier organizers looking at the toolbox widget it's veteran and mechanic owned the one box will include 12 organizers so you get a good amount of organizers here and just like all of the other toolbox toolbox widget items they do connect and disconnect so you can make them the length that you want to fit any drawer on the back here you can see you can connect and add however many you need to fit the drawer or fit your needs it has a missing tool indicator. You can see the orange strip. It's like that with all of their organizers. And I'll post a picture up in here of this design for the pliers compared to uh, their design that they use for wrenches and their screwdrivers and everything. So they're a little bit different. And then with the plier organizer, you're going to get two different widths. Uh, you're gonna get two of these and 10 of these. So two of the wider ones. And that's going to be for your larger pliers so it's nice that they've thought of that and because sometimes when you order an organizer especially like socket organizers sometimes the the pegs that are just a stationary distance apart you can't fit certain sockets next to each other so it's nice that they've thought of that as well it's got strong magnets and it will hold through uh, thinner drawer liners but there's gonna be enough weight on these that they're not gonna go anywhere anyways. So through like this drawer liner that we have here, it would work perfectly fine through this. It does have a good magnet on the bottom side. They're one and a half inches tall, so they do fit in most drawers. So 10 of them are gonna be 13 millimeters wide, and then two of them are gonna be 18 millimeters wide. Lifetime warranty and customer satisfaction, satisfaction guaranteed. Besides that, I've already said they have a nice strong magnet on the bottom. They have the missing tool indicator, and like I said, you can connect them or disconnect them to fit your needs. And uh, they're high quality, just like all of their other ones. So these are going to run the same price. All of their organizers are the same price. Their socket organizer, their wrench organizer, screwdriver organizer, plier organizer, they're all the same cost. For one box, it's going to be $25. So it is on the higher end of organizers and it will get expensive if you have a lot of tools, but in the end, it really makes up for it. It saves me a lot of time and I just, I haven't found a downside to any of the toolbox widget items that I have besides the price point being a little bit higher than your standard organizer. But it's also way more versatile than any other organizer. So now that we've kind of taken a quick look at these, we'll go ahead and get these put into my pliers drawer. So here we are looking at my pliers drawer and this is the wire organizer I have. I've had it for quite a few years and I cut it in half in order for it to fit this direction in the drawer back when I first started getting tools in this toolbox. And then I expanded and now I have way more pliers than I need 
uh, and then here's the Tekton organizers that I have and uh, see how well it holds all of these pliers because I have a very wide variety of different sizes and styles of pliers. So we'll go ahead and get these pliers out of here and we'll get the toolbox widget installed. So without a pliers organizer, your drawer would probably look something similar to this and double stacked and at least the first half of this drawer forward, it would probably look something similar to this or you know, they'd be just kind of thrown in here and you can grab and go. Um, but with pliers laying down like this, they do take up a lot more room than when you have an organizer that actually stands them up on their side. It really does save up a lot of room. So if your drawer looks similar to this without an organizer, in general, just look into getting an organizer. It will save you a lot of time in the long run. You'll just be a lot happier with an organized plier drawer. And who knows, maybe we'll end up doing a giveaway of these plier organizers that I won't be using if I enjoy the way the toolbox widget fits all of my pliers. So I have a feeling we're gonna have no issues. So maybe this will be a future giveaway. So I'm gonna try and do this the best that I can. I kind of have everything organized so I can kind of lay it out. I got my wider ones over here. So I'm gonna start off with like my adjustable wrenches and locking pliers, the larger items over here. And then we'll go down here and work into the bottom row. Let's get to it. And that is it as far as my pliers, these spring-loaded ones, I either like to remove the spring or I put a zip tie around them because uh, I don't like the handles sticking up. So like all of my uh, flush cuts, I usually put a zip tie around. So that's it. I'll bring you guys in for a closer look. So it is really nice that if you come across a set of pliers with bigger handles on them, like the band pliers here with thicker rubber, I was able to use one of the wider toolbox widgets in order to fit that in there. And then same thing went with the Knipex bolt cutters. And then all of these items over here really needed uh, a wider one. Everything fits really nicely. It's all low profile. So it fits in this drawer very well. And uh, I like how I could make the adjustments with the thin and wide ones and it matches my drawer size perfectly. I'm sure I'll be doing some arranging through time, but as of right now, I think it's a fantastic organizer, just like their wrench organizer and their screwdriver organizer, which I'm sure I've posted pictures of, but they work great. I use them for all sorts of tools. You got your angled ones as well. I mean, it doesn't get much more organized than that. So I can't say how happy I am with the toolbox widget organizers. I think they're doing great things. I think they put a lot of thought into it as far as the design of the shape as to what tool sits in the organizer and how it sits in there the best. So I'm glad they put some thought into it. I like that there is a missing tool indicator for any of those so obviously i still have room to grow <laughs> not that i necessarily need to but i definitely have plenty more room i have a couple spaces over here i just kind of separated my diagonal side cutters from my flush cuts and then my long nose pliers from my snap ring pliers and stuff like that just to kind of keep it easy to find things all of my slip joint pliers here long reach pliers, tongue and groove pliers, and adjustable wrenches. So let me know your guys' thoughts. I think it's a great organizer. Once again, I'll have it linked down below. Uh, so it is a 12 piece organizer in each box and it runs $25. So a little bit more 
than your average organizer, but it does a great job. So once again, share your thoughts down in the comments if you guys have used any of the toolbox widget items in the past and what you think about this. And then stay tuned for the socket organizer, which we will be redoing my drawers as far as sockets. So stay tuned for that. If you guys enjoyed, please make sure to hit that thumbs up, leave a comment down below. And as always, if you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing. See you guys next time.